Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to edit the drums in GarageBand. This is a very simple thing to do, so make sure that you watch this quick and easy video to the very end and follow my steps correctly, so you can make sure that this works the same for you and you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. So guys, the first thing you want to do is go ahead and open up the official GarageBand application on your mobile phone if you're not already. If you do not have the application, just go to the App Store and download it. And after opening it up, you'll be greeted by this main page right here, which is the home page where you can find all the instruments you can play, you can find the audio recorder and so on. So let's go ahead and see how to get started with editing our drums. What we want to do first, guys, is go ahead and find the drums right here in our instrument. So go ahead and scroll until you find the drums. As you can see, here we have our drums section. So under drums, now we have multiple options. We can play smart drums, we have our acoustic drums, beat sequencer, or we can click on the more sounds option. That's going to find us and enable us to find all the drums we can use, such as electronic, percussion, and so on. So here you can get started. So open up your desired drums by tapping on them. And as you can see, this is now going to open up this recording menu where we can get started recording our drums, as you can see. You can play your drums by tapping on them and you can use the big red circle at the top of the screen to get started recording those drums. So click on the big red circle, record your drums and after you're finished, you'll be able to find it right here in the upper left corner by clicking this menu that's going to open up this editing menu, mixing menu where you can find all the instruments we have played. As you can see, here is our drums track. So guys, here are our drums and now we can go ahead and tap on them. We can edit them. As you can see, there is an edit button or you can go ahead and tap right here on the sliders option at the top of the screen to find your options such as plugins, equalizers, master effects and so on to get your desired effects and start editing your drums but yeah guys basically that is it how did you get started so i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel so you guys thanks for watching take care and bye